Hey guys. Welcome to Couple. Please like and subscribe if you like this video. When President Donald Trump captured the White House in 2016, he won with an electoral map that showed a shift in long-standing voting patterns, hammering away at the Democrats' big blue wall of states in the upper Midwest. New state polls from Marist this week, however, suggest those older patterns may be remerging in favor of the Democrats this year and they could have big impacts this November and beyond. Trump won the presidency with victories in Wisconsin and Michigan, states no Republican presidential candidate had won in more than a quarter century. He also got within two points of winning Minnesota, a state that has not voted for a GOP presidential nominee since 1972. His success in those places was largely viewed as a part of Trump's broad appeal with blue-collar manufacturing voters. All three of those states are in the top 10 for manufacturing employment in the United States, according to the U.S. Census. But this week a set of NBC News slash Marist polls showed Trump's approval rating was deep underwater in those states. He didn't break 40% job approval with registered voters in any state and his job disapproval number was above 50% in all of them.